While I was editing this video, I actually found an amazing deal. A collection bars for less than $10. It even includes these as a bonus. Let me share my secret. Okay, let's try Gumtree Australia. Oh, what? Oh, the white logo with boxes for only $1,500 Australian dollars. In the span of one month, I managed to find one of the most elusive woodies available in the market. And I got three of them for three different countries. Hey guys, ZW back here with another video. And I'm not trying to show off, maybe a little. But no, today I'm going to share with you some tips on how to get hard to find items at a great deal. Now, if you still think that you can get this from stores or toy shops, Wake up. These are not available anymore and you have to get them from resellers or collectors. And one of my favourite sites to get these collectibles is from Japan. No, not just from the country Japan, as in the website is called From Japan. This cloud logo woody was found on a platform called Yahoo Auction Japan. Basically, not everyone offers international shipping when they're selling stuff, right? So sometimes you need to engage in a forwarding service to forward the item to you after you have bought something. Thankfully, the Toy Story collection were also available in Japan 10 years ago. So, right now, there are people trying to get rid of this without knowing the true value 10 years later. This are everything I got from Japan using the service from Japan. This Jessie with real denim cost me about 11k yen, which is about USD $100. This Rex cost me about 22k yen, which is about USD $200. These three card logos came as a set. I only really wanted Woody, but they were listed together with a starting bid of 28K. And I think because there was some yellowing and this coloration on the box, no one was really interested in them. So I actually won the auction with no other contenders. After paying domestic shipping, service charge, insurance plan, and international shipping, this all came out to be roughly USD 300 total. Cut that in half because I don't think this potato head is worth anything. This woody costs about 150 USD. That's a pretty good deal considering how much people are selling them right now. Try finding that on eBay. Challenge accepted. So here's the deal. If you are rich, like what your butt with $100 bill rich, go ahead and buy everything on eBay. Because you can buy anything there. But make sure not to return to eBay because you will definitely find a cheaper listing of the same item. And I can't tell you how many times I thought I got a good deal and a better one appears. This woody I bought from eBay is significantly cheaper than the one I bought from Japan. They look pretty similar. The vest on the eBay one is smaller, but their denim jeans are pretty much the same. Their height is the same, so this is probably also a cloud logo woody because the white logo woody is shorter. It came with a hat but not a stand or a box. And the reason I found this is because this is the cover photo of the listing. Vouchers like us are trained to watch out for number one, the cloud logo. The blue background with the white cloud, yes, if you see that, click on it and check the price. Number two, the denim jeans. If you can identify it accurately, click on it and check the price. But this was neither, it's just a woody face. It might as well be one of the 69,000 variations of woodies that Tinkway has made throughout the years. So when people were scrolling through the listings, they didn't even notice that. Well, for me, I'm just gonna admit it. I was lucky. I just happened to click on the listing and when I scrolled to the second photo, man, I cannot emphasize the disbelief that I was in. I was rubbing my eyes, zooming in and out constantly and comparing the photos with this woody. And when I checked the price, it wasn't even a bid. Usually it would be a bid that lasts for about 7 days and by then everyone would have known about this. But it's just a buy it now price at $80 with free shipping. Just be patient and check eBay from time to time and maybe you will be the next lucky bastard to get a deal of a lifetime. But if you don't have the patience and you want to try your luck, depending on where you live, you will have a website or an application that people in your country like to use. And for Singapore and many other Asian countries, we use Carousel. You know, like the merry-go-round carousel with an extra L. I don't know, it doesn't make sense, but we love it. For Americans, I think you all use Mercari. And for Australians, I know they like to use Gumtree. Another popular platform would be Facebook Marketplace. Let me show you what I mean. Just a quick search on a Facebook Marketplace in the US, and I've already found a crazy deal. $100 for the whole lot, and it includes a Toy Story collection RC with the remote? 
It even has a collection not so collection bars and a collection boost eye. Dude, the RC alone is already more than $100. What a steal! But it might be gone already because it was listed 12 weeks ago. Just a few quick scrolls, I found another collection bus for $10. Oh wow. I don't know why, but maybe these apps are usually not accessible international, so there are less competition. But you can find imbeciles. No. Ignorant. No, sorry. What's the word I'm looking for? It innocent. Yeah, innocent. Innocent parents trying to sell their children's toys and more often than not, they are poorly priced. Okay, let's try Gumtree Australia. Straight away, you can see people getting rid of their entire Toy Story collection. Oh, what? Oh, the white logo with boxes for only 1500 Australian dollars. Oh, my heart. Oh, what is, what, what is going on? The, the Rex and the potato head is already more than 1500 Australian dollars. Not to mention Pricker Pants, Dolly and Buttercup with boxers. And how much do we want to bet that the Woody and the Jessie has real denim jeans? Oh, I can't find any close-up. Dude, any Australians watching this right now, please, for my sake, please, go and buy this from Annabelle. Cause what's not available anymore is this Woody that I bought from Carousel. It is also of the same height as the other two, so I was extra lucky to get another original cloud logo. The vest is similar to the Japanese Woody, so it's longer than the one I got from America. Of course, the denim feels as awesome as it can be. Granted, it's a little yellowish and dirtier because it's at least 10 years old. So I will have to wash them before modding them. And it was only 20 USD shit. Can you believe it? 20 USD for a real denim jeans woody. No. Cause before this, I actually missed two woodies with real denim jeans and they are also ridiculously priced. And I did manage to track down one of the sellers and he told me that he up Graded his Woody by selling his old one with real denim jeans and replacing it with a signature collection Woody. Oh. Oh. This might be the hardest video I've ever done. Oh my heart. Oh, I can't take it anymore. As for the amazing deal that I mentioned at the start of the video, I also got it locally. I immediately recognized that it's a collection bus because of his clear wing tips meaning it has actual light. And it cost me only 8 Singapore dollars for 4 toys, which meant that bus is only $2. If you like Toy Story, I have an epic unboxing over here, or you can watch my other customs over here. Stay tuned to the channel because I will have another unboxing coming soon. See you.